real quick real quick I will do a full video of my jumbo when it's done today's video is going to be all over the place but pretty much what I'm doing and in installing is new spotlight new nav light a swivel for the seat both side of the bearing new trailer lights I have to do this every year I'm gonna do it right this time and a new or actually yes I'm belch pump got a couple things to do big mess to play with and uh, hopefully I can get all that done today I got everything planned throughout this whole week I've been messing with these lights so these wires are pretty much ready to go and uh, while I've been doing that I've been waiting for this switch panel to come through finally did, finally did yesterday this thing is like a fidget so satisfying alright enough plan got to wire this up and then I'll uh, power it up and see if the lights will work stay tuned okay folks the first thing I did was this aluminum piece here I believe it was for a fish finder for this boat in the past I went ahead and take it off from the boat cut a perfect square on it and using this as a holder for my switch panel pretty neat time to file it for good looks I'm gonna spray paint this thing Back from Menards. That thing should be dried up. Yes, it is. Went to get some uh, hardware from Menards. Once again, this should be the last time I go to the store. Fingers crossed. Check out that plate. It got some extra holes in there, but oh well. Ain't that good looking or what? Oh yeah. Check out that headache. So, I got everything wired up. I went to O'Reilly. My batteries went bad, and uh, I got some stuff to cover up wires. So, I got these uh, braided wire uh, looms and then this hose clamp. All right, guys, after one week of hooking everything up. I swear guys, I have not tested anything, and this is literally the first go. Alright, so I got my Markham battery here. If anything lights up, then uh, folks, we're going fishing. Oh! Oh, we got power, yo! We got power. We got power to the switch and uh, got the lights on, voltmeter, USB plug. Let's freaking go. All right, moment of truth. These are my nav lights. I got two. Moment of truth. Freaking go. Keep it on. Let's go check out. So I hooked up this light and then I got it hooked up another parallel on that side. I don't know if you guys ever seen this thing, but this thing is pretty sweet. So I hooked up one here to the main nav light and pretty much connect it and now this thing works. So I have one more on this side. So I'm going to cut uh, red and black wire. Bring it all the way and hook it up once again right here.
and then got the red and green nav light on also that's freaking go after a week of connecting a bunch of wires folks when I connect everything all I did was connect positive to positive negative to negative and then fed everything up to the switch and that was the first run and uh, I think I should become an electrician because that was the first try fingers crossed that it stays on and nothing you know tweak on me but hey we got power the boat is about 80% done now we just got change wheel bearing and uh folks we're ready for bass over there let's go check out this awesomeness oh This thing is absolutely sweet. Now that it got a little darker, she got a little better. Pretty bright. Up front. Got the deck going. Along with green and red light. Let's go ahead and check out the spotlight. Turn that off. That's wicked. Wicked, wicked. Got everything glowing nice and bright. I'm super excited.